April is Earth Month, and what better way to celebrate than with Miss Rhode Island Earth, Alexander Curtis, and Elite Miss Rhode Island 2019, Laura Barlow. Mm -hmm. Welcome back, ladies. Good morning. Hi, good morning. Yeah, we've been here for other things <laughs> yes. in the past. Um, yes. Let's start by talking about Miss Earth USA. Mm -hmm. Alex, Ali, can you uh, tell us a little bit about the pageant itself? Sure. So, Miss Earth USA is an environmentally friendly, sustainable pageant, and we go on to the Miss Earth competition. So, it's an internationally recognized competition for women who are looking to advance environmental platforms in their communities. Laura, who is this uh, pageant open to and when is it taking place? Yeah, so actually we're super excited because the pageant this summer is taking place in Las Vegas wow. and there's a few different pageants, that's why we have some different divisions mm -hmm. and the Elite Miss pageant and the Teen Miss pageant is happening on June 30th and, oh I'm sorry, on July 1st and Allie's pageant, the Miss pageant is happening on June 30th. So, so an exciting weekend there yes. in Vegas. Um, who who can compete? Like you said, I know you, you mentioned like the different age ranges, but is there are there certain age ranges for elite versus Miss Earth and is there a Mrs. Definitely. Earth too yes, that I was seeing in the side? Okay. Too, absolutely. So we have all of these different opportunities for women who are mm -hmm. interested in getting involved. For my division, it's 18 to 28 years old. Okay. And yeah, and we have opportunities for ages 5 to 59. Whoa. There's a little miss, a junior miss, a teen miss, a miss, an elite miss, and a missus. So it's really, um, Miss Earth is a great opportunity for women of all different ages to get involved. Mm -hmm. And we talk about Miss Earth and, and the Earth itself, you know, ways that we can be environmentally friendly, mm -hmm. maybe even especially this month. Allie, what are some ways that we could do that? So something that I'm really passionate about is reducing your waste. And mm -hmm. I actually don't use liquid shampoo. I have a shampoo bar and I use it in a tin that I've actually had since 2012. So for seven Whoa. years, I have been able to reduce my shampoo bottle waste. Yeah, I can't even imagine <laughs> the amount of shampoo bottles I have I've could tally up since since that time. So that's a great way to do that. And Laura, tell us a little bit about your platform. Sure, great, thank you. My platform is Fight Climate Change with Diet Change because I'm a huge component of educating people about the devastating environmental impact of animal agriculture. Oh. Me and Allie are actually, we both found, vegan. we're both vegan, <laughs> we found out we had a lot in common. So um, I'm using my, my year of service to really educate people about how reducing their consumption of meat and dairy can really um, help have a wonderful impact on our planet and our mother earth. Wow, who knew? Yeah, an impact on your body and, and yes. the earth itself. And Allie, your platform. So my platform is called Leading Ladies and for the past six years or so I've been advocating to get more women in positions of leadership in places where they've been underrepresented, especially in civic engagement. So this year I'm really focusing on getting more women not only in places where they can make a positive change in their communities, mm -hmm. but doing so in a way that's changing the future for our climate. Wow. Well, you, you girls are doing so much, not only you know for yourselves, but for the environment as well. Does it mean a lot to to be part of a pageant like this that has you know a little more to it to know that you're making an, a real big impact yes definitely that's actually why I picked this pageant mm -hmm. because this is my first pageant um, and I really did it because of the earth component yeah. Wonderful. And Allie, I know you've, you're no stranger to the no, pageant it's world. It's my first rodeo. <laughs> no. but, um, is this your first uh, Miss Earth? My though? first Miss Earth. And it's something that I've been wanting to do, and I'm so excited to have the opportunity, especially because it really does have that mm -hmm. extra component of meaning with the environment. Certainly. Well, it's perfect timing mm -hmm. that you guys are joining us during Earth Month. Thank you both so much. Thank, and thank you. Best of luck in Las Vegas. Thank you so much. Thank thank you so much. Have fun with the weather out there, regardless. <laughs> <laughs> For more information on Earth Month or Miss Earth, you can head on over to roadshow.com.